president declaring victory on Twitter over stopping migrants traveling in a caravan in Mexico seeking political asylum and stating border crossings are at a still unacceptable 46-year low. Stop drugs. The tweet after he officially approved sending National Guard troops to the border to help stem the flow. All of the numbers are going up, so we are at a crisis point. We'd like to stop it before the numbers get even bigger. Even as crossings ticked up in March, overall they are down nearly 13 percent compared to last year. But 2017 had the lowest recorded illegal crossings since 1972. And while governors from some border states agree, not everyone is behind the move. The sheriff of a border town in Arizona is worried. What's happening? Do we have a war with immigrants? And California officials want more details that right now the Department of Defense can't provide. Depending on the situation, it will be dependent, possibly unique from state to state. Which means those that are deployed, like past presidential National Guard deployments, are there for surveillance and support only. As for his border wall, after the president suggested he might try to use Defense Department funds to build it, which would require congressional approval, the White House tried to clarify. We're looking into options for the military to build wall on military installations on the border. Pentagon officials, though, tell ABC News the military doesn't actually own any land on the U.S.-Mexico border. Mexico cautions that they will defend their own sovereignty, but have been assured by the administration that these troops won't be armed and won't carry out any customs or immigration enforcement.